This story will both break and warm your heart. A six-year-old girl is healthy one day, then sick the next. With something no doctor so far can explain. And now, her parents are searching for answers only to learn a valuable life lesson in the process. Brenda Lee Gonzalez has the story you will only see here on Denver 7. This is Abigail at age five recording a video of herself just eight months ago. A happy little girl full of life and energy and spunky. No one would ever guess that just one day later, so much would change. Worst news mother and father could ever hear. Abigail was rushed to the hospital for a stomach ache, but not just any stomach ache. Last time she'd had one, she nearly died, and doctors couldn't find a diagnosis. This time, though, she'd need surgery. Joy and I were both really leery about going into surgery because she hadn't done well under anesthesia before. Doctors can't explain why Abigail went into cardiac arrest during the surgery, but it left her without oxygen for nearly 30 minutes. They made us aware, too, that um, it had been a long time and that it's very likely that she will have no brain activity. Today, Abby, can you wake up? Abby may not be able to walk or talk on her own. She understands everything that's coming in. But there's one thing she hasn't lost. Ha <laughs> ha, I beat daddy. Yeah, I beat daddy. <laughs> that beautiful smile. Makes all of our days when she smiles. Yet, she's still in a lot of pain. <laughs> And her parents haven't gotten any answers. She deserves every chance to figure out what's wrong with her so that she can go on. Just her, her being and her determination, I think, keep us all going. Abby's story isn't just inspiring her parents. I want to be nice to Abby and help her. It spread from her home in Erie to this classroom at Vivian Elementary nearly 30 miles away. Immediately, they connected to her. Carol Sauer wanted to use Abby's recovery process as a lesson for her third graders. You can't see Abby smile without feeling like there's something that you want to do. A teaching about hard work. I went outside to my house in my neighborhoods and I sold bracelets and I got $600 from just doing that. And giving. These are not kids who have an abundance of monetary resources. In the end, $1,090 and five cents. She's learned something herself. It doesn't take money, it takes energy to make a difference. Neither of these students, not even Miss Sauer, have ever met Abby. I think that she's a, probably a sweet little girl. Yet, what does it do for your heart? Make my heart go off, okay? Joy and Kyle Colbert already know a lot about them. It restores your faith in humanity. It's pretty amazing. They're hopeful one day. She's going to be okay. Somehow, some way, we're going to figure this out. Abby will be able to thank them herself. This little girl, she's, she's supposed to be here. Brenda Lee Gonzalez. Oh, I'm going to kiss you. Oh. Denver 7. Wow, such kindness and compassion.